In sports, concussions happen. High school and college athletes suffer the most often in football, ice hockey, and soccer. Concussions don't always mean being knocked out or a loss of consciousness. They can also cause confusion, dizziness, and vision problems. But time is of the essence. Any possible concussion needs prompt attention because sometimes there's potential for a more serious injury. Now, a smartphone on the field might be a good tool to spot signs of concussion earlier. Inside Science. When somebody experiences a concussive event, they typically take them off the field and they go through their basic protocol. That protocol typically includes a pen light test where they shine a light in a person's eyes to see how their pupil reacts. If a person has a concussion, doctors can usually see a change in the pupil of the eye. The pupil usually reacts in a sluggish manner and it usually has a larger diameter towards the end of the test than what it typically would. Now, Sluis and his team have developed an app that uses a cell phone to do a similar pen-like pupil eye test. The application, it's just an app, no additional hardware needed. It uses the camera and light on the back of the phone. And all you do is hold it up to the person's eye. You line up their eye into the viewfinder. The app, called Reflex, takes a digital video recording of the eye to measure a response called pupillary light reflex. The camera's flash causes the pupil to constrict in response to the light. The app measures the time it takes for the pupil to react, the constriction and dilation rates of the pupil, plus other relevant data. Changes in pupil response have been correlated with brain injuries like concussions. What it does is give parameters associated with the pupillary response, and the application we're building is the one that would indicate whether or not a concussive event has occurred and that you do need to seek medical attention. So our primary focus is to make sure we get this into the hands of the people that need it. So this would be athletic trainers, sports medicine physicians, general practitioners that may experience that. The app is available for iPhones and is not meant as a primary diagnosis, but can be used to indicate there could be a problem and additional medical attention is needed. Inside Science. If you enjoyed this edition, Follow us on the web and social media. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.